All right, this is a mock-up test of the Flash Technology Vanguard FTS 370. Pick this up to replace an older Xenon-based system that's on our amateur radio tower in uh, Pine County, Minnesota. So you see here we got the control box, a temporary three conductor uh, flash head cable, and the flash head here. I'll show you inside of that. Big old LED system there, and some stuff here. So that's plugged in there. Control box, uh, 110 volts AC. And also underneath my shoe here, the photovoltaic module, which detects day and night mode. So I wanted to put that over there so that it would start up in night mode. And then I got an extension cord run across the floor here over to the, the wall. Let's power this thing on here and see what happens. Okay, we got light. That's good. Whoa, that's bright. Wow, is that bright? <clears throat> okay, I guess it didn't start up in night mode. <laughs> LEDs there. It's kind of nice. It shows all alarms right now. I'm guessing it's in a, a boot up cycle or something. So far, so good. Okay, just heard a relay click. Now it says day mode, red night. And so now it says F night as well. And Now we got red. We're still showing all alarms, but I'm assuming it's probably still booting. And all those red alarm lights will go out. Okay, let's uncover the, the module here. Let's see if we get day mode again. suspense. I'm guessing there's a delay on it so it doesn't go between the two a bunch. Okay, there's all the errors or the alarms cleared. Still shows a night mode. I'll have to look up what all that is. Oh, there we go, day mode. Cool. And there's a whole programming guide there that I'll go through once we get it mounted on the tower. All right, awesome. Looks like this thing is working as designed. Approved by the dog. <laughs>